Well, getting a sneak peek onto the field wasn't exclusive to just the media today. Hundreds of fans have been waiting for a chance to see their team in action for months now, and today they got that opportunity. NBC 26's Eric Kress continues our live team coverage tonight from Clark Hinkle Field. Today was the first time that most even saw the Packers since last season. And just getting a view from the other side of a fence for practice was a big deal for many. Some call these Packers fans railbirds on the account of their seating or lack thereof, I suppose. At least I'm six feet so I can kind of see over some people. But let's just call them fans who are willing to go the distance. Living in Alabama, you do not get to see your, your guys at all. So you get a chance like this, unique opportunity, you have to take it. You, you can't pass it up. And even for those who didn't have to travel too far, just getting a glimpse into the Packers 2015 roster is a big deal. It's free. It's great to see young talent, see the stars too, and realize it's uh, three miles or four miles from my house. They don't see anything you know, except just a little scrimmage, but it's seeing their Packers. And while hundreds line the boulevard for a view, it was a little crowded. Being a railbird, or rather a fan. I couldn't think of anything else I'd rather be doing right now doesn't mean you have to follow the crowd's every move. The next time you'll be able to see the Packers practice in public will be June 2nd and June 10th. But of course, until then, you can always get your Packers updates right here on NBC 26. Until then, I'm live in Ashwaubenon from what was the best seat in the house, Eric Crest. That is a good seat. Be careful there. Fans were able to take pictures of the Packers at work today. It's what makes Green Bay different from other teams in the NFL. The next chance to see the Packers on the practice field comes next Tuesday from 1130 to 130, weather permitting. And we want to see your Packers pictures. You can email them to icontribute at NBC26.com or share them on our NBC26 Facebook page.